Hi peeps. Scarlet Brown here. Before we begin this episode, I'm required to tell you this is another what if episode, meaning it will be a flash forward to 2035 yet again, and we'll see what it'll be like if I do have a daughter of my own. Here we go. What a lucky girl I am to be getting away with. So it is true. You're bunking off school. No, I'm not. For heaven's sake, Lily. You're 14 now. How dare you bunk off school and lie to me about it. Whatever. No, it's not whatever, young lady. If your grandmother was here, she'd drag you into school by the scruff of your neck. Get into school this instant. You're very naughty. No. That's it. You're grounded. I will not tolerate you behaving like this whatsoever, and if you don't stop it, I will send you off to a reform camp, Scarlet. It's mummy. Can you hear me? Yes I can. You've been sitting here staring into space for the last minute or so now. Are you okay? I'm fine thanks mum. I was just having a flash forward. That's all. I see. To which year did you flash forward? 2035. And I may have a teenage daughter who rebels against my house rules. Disobeying my every instruction and warning, Scarlet, that's twenty years away. You're only twelve right now, so you've got two decades to think about your future, maybe six years. According to the Flash Forward timeline, I am thirty-two and my daughter's fourteen, which means if I do have a daughter, I'll be eighteen at the time of her birth. I see. That's only if our creator decides not to keep us at the same ages anymore and ages us up again. I heard he's going to do that in the next time skip. 